Hey, what's going on YouTube? Uh, I'm going to show you guys my new toy I got in the mail the other day. And it's a Lee um, XR hand priming tool. And uh, it's, it's miles, miles, miles away from the standard uh, old, old-timey way of priming um, uh, cartridges, ca cartridge cases with this old classic uh, Lee Reloader. And how you would do this on the old one is you would get your one primer at a time. Let's go ahead and pop one out. So you get your one primer, put it in here. You would get your cartridge. You would lube it up. You would stick it in here. And then you would actually drill down on this thing with a non-marring hammer and that would seat the bullet or pardon me seat the primer so this is uh... it's a little more dangerous you know involving you know blunt force to the actual primer and uh... just it's just a lot slower and honestly i didn't feel comfortable doing it especially not on a large scale so i opted to uh... look into their uh... hand priming tool and i'm gonna go ahead and show you how this is done um, First things first, to get this case on and off, you push down, or pardon me, say, I guess it comes with two different sizes. It's got a large primer and a small primer thing. And to simply take this thing apart, you just pull off this handle right here. Okay, that just pops right off. And then the case just slides right off. And like I said, this comes with two different cases. And uh, of course, today we're going to be using the small pistol primer casing. Okay, so let's go ahead and put this back in here. We're going to put our lever back in there. Okay, it's working. And uh, this case thing just slides right off. And uh, the way you get the actual shell holder in here is you depress the case the primer holding case and uh, your case holder just, just slides right in there so you depress that, slide your case holder in there go ahead and bring it up there make sure it is lined up there properly okay and we're going to go and put this primer in here and uh, actually let's go and pull this one out, we're going to put a few more in there Okay. And you want to go ahead and make sure you get all your primers uh, facing up. This part right here is really the most time consuming as far as prepping and getting, re getting you ready. Okay, so we've got all these down, or face side up. You want to make sure you don't have your primers where it's uh, illustrated to not have any primers. Let's go ahead and slide your case back on there. Okay, and you're ready to rock. So I'm going to go ahead and bring these back down here. And uh, as you can see right here, there is an open chamber right here. That's how you allow the first primer to go in there. So we're going to set that back down here, get that out of the uh, loaded position. Get some eye protection on because there is always the possibility one of these things could go off in your face and you don't want that to happen and hit your eyes. So we've got the eye protection on. We're going to go ahead and get our empty shell casings. And uh, it's always a good idea to double check and make sure you don't have a spent primer or even a live primer in your case before you put it in here. Okay. So you want to hold this uh, facing away. They recommend to treat this like a loaded gun, which is definitely not a bad idea. Go ahead and put your your shell in there, your empty shell. You want to press up just a little bit to get that first primer to drop down in there. Once it drops in there, go ahead and drop it back down and then bring it all the way up. And uh, this thing is pretty cool. It um, It's very, very fast and very effective. You see you've got one done right there. We've already got the next primer in the chamber ready to get primed. Okay, that one's done. Go ahead and do another one. OK, 
Okay, three. There's four. There's number five. Six. Seven. Eight. There's nine. Ten. Eleven. There's twelve. Thirteen. Fourteen. Sixteen, nineteen, and here's number twenty right here. Okay, so that's twenty uh, primed bullets out of this thing. That's a lot faster than. Um, the previous method of doing this, so um, it's it's definitely a good device, and for uh, I think I spent thirty dollars on this. That was with the shipping included. You really can't beat it, and uh, like I said, it's got two different size trays, one for large and small primers. And of course, um, one thing you will have to consider purchasing is getting the proper shell holder. And I would like to go ahead and mention that you do have to buy shell holders that are made specifically for these hand loaders not you can't use one that's for a um, a bench press or anything like that so make sure you do get the proper um, shell holders and just be careful <laughs> but it, it's definitely very effective uh, very quick very I would say much safer than previous methods and, and you, you've also got uh, a little more control over it um, you, you just you, you can feel the primers being seated, and, and it just it feels feels a lot better than than previous methods of of loading these primers in there. But yeah, uh, there it is, uh, the Lee hand priming tool.